I will compare the dying light to paraglider to the Horizon Forbidden West Shield Wing Glider. First, we'll do the Dying Light 2. So, we will get the Dying Light 2 Paraglider as part of the main mission. So, you will get it eventually if you just keep following the main quest. 10 years of this fucking darkness. We gotta check this out. How do we get to the substation? It's an old paraglider. It'll help you get to places you normally can't reach. Just follow me. Bond, wait! Fuck. In Dying Light 2, the paraglider is flight limited by the amount of stamina you have but you can extend it by hovering over air vents on the ground. Nice! But you better keep practicing if you hope to beat me. I didn't know it was a race. It's always a race, Aiden. Now for Horizon Forbidden West and the glider is called a shield wing glider. You get this glider from defeating a boss fight that's part of the main quest. The boss is called you, Gruda. Outlanders, I'll skin you both. Chief, grant me the honor of this challenge. Granted. A shield like that. Better scan it.
It's salvage time, boys. And after you have defeated Gruda, Eloy will take the shield wing glider from Gruda's arm. I don't think it can take a hit. I should be able to use it to glide. The Horizon Forbidden West Seal Wing Glider is not stamina limited, unlike Dying Light 2 Paraglider. So basically, you can fly as far as you want as long as you climb high enough. Thanks for watching, I appreciate it if you subscribe, please give video a like, and we'll see you next time.